I'm currently working at St. Francis Counselor Training Institute. Our mission at St. Francis is to train counselors who will be ethical and compassionate human beings uh, with a desire to serve the nation. This is not a bad place to start talking about St. Francis because this is a tool that we use here and it's quite unique in this country. It's an experiential tool and I think at the moment we're probably the only institute that trains students in the use of this tool. Uh, what we actually do at St. Francis Counselor Training Institute is uh, we train counselors at certificate level, at diploma level, bachelor's level and postgraduate level. Then uh, the services that we provide, we provide counseling services to individuals, couples, to groups, to families, uh, children. I'm in charge of the tailoring school. Uh, our school conducts a program that lasts two years, and our students come from uh, different backgrounds, but mostly from uh, disadvantaged families. I'm Tinuk, which is a Gloria, first year in St. Francis Tailoring School. I'm 19 years of age. And uh, they pay a small fee, which cannot meet all our costs. So what we do is that we have to produce some items for sale and when we sell them the, the school comes the money comes back to the school and we are able to take care for our expenses that normally wouldn't have been covered by their fee which is quite small. When they leave the school it's quite a challenge but uh, we have encouraged them to form groups uh, so that they can be able to access loans if they want. Of recent we also received a program from the government of Uganda and that program is for a shorter period, that is three months. This program is also uh, geared towards helping the young people from the age of 18 to 35 to be able to get quicker skills which they can in turn go back and apply and be able to start making some money and as well to be able to take care of themselves. And so we are happy with our program and would want it to continue to help our, our young boys and girls so that they can be able to be self-sustainable in the future. I'm working with the St. Francis Family Help Program. I am heading Child Sponsorship Department. Sponsoring children, especially who are disadvantaged, born from poor backgrounds, poor families. Each child has a, a sponsor, and in all now they are above they are uh, 231 children. Each sponsor is asked contribute the amount of uh, about 450 dollars a year which will meet the needs of the child, the school fees, the school needs, uh, guidance and counseling services. Uh, these children write letters three times a year to their sponsors and they send them school reports to show their academic, perform academic performance they can contribute for improving the standard of living of these needy children as they grow up to empower them 